If you want a cheaper and faster way to get Rocket League items, head over to RL Exchange and use code Coke. They have tons of your favorite items to choose from, so you can build the car that you've always wanted. And the best part is they deliver these items to any console insanely fast and have tons of payment methods that you can choose from. Just use the link in the description to go check it out for yourself. Hello everyone, welcome back to another video. Today we're doing another Rocket League crate opening video, except this time we cannot end the video until we get a titanium white mainframe. And speaking of titanium white items, every thousand subs on this channel, we give away a titanium white octane to one of you. And all you have to do to enter is subscribe to the channel and comment something down below. Now you're probably thinking, Coral, how do you plan on getting a white mainframe this video? Well, that's how, all right? We got 1,000 crates. If we cannot get a white mainframe, from 1,000 crates, our luck is terrible. And I'll be honest with you guys, that was not a real crate. Obviously, my luck isn't good enough to get a black market on the very first crate. These are modded drops. I wasn't about to trade for 1,000 real drops, but they open the exact same items. And the odds are a little bit, you know, they're a little bit skewed. You know, it's like the same odds for every single rarity, but that gives us the better chance of black markets and it gives us a better chance of mainframes which in turn gives us better chance of titanium white mainframes which would be dope to open in a video i i can't even remember the last time i opened a white mainframe in a video obviously i've never opened a real one but even the modded ones it's very difficult to get a white mainframe like this is going to be challenging. We got Zombas unpainted though. Uh, would have been nice to get some paint on there. Uh, but I don't think I'm gonna cut anything from this video. I think I'm just gonna leave it at whatever length it is. So whatever you guys see the timestamp on this video is, that's just completely uncut, just raw, unedited, straight from start to finish. That's just how we're gonna do it today, okay? I really wanna just show you guys how dedicated I am to getting bangers, okay? We will not stop this video until we get the white mainframe. It could take two hours. This could be a two hour long video. You think I care? Ooh, crimson mainframe, okay. What if we got it right there and it was like a two minute video? That'd be funny, actually. <laughs> Here I am prepared to do two hours and it just, gifts me with like a two minute white mainframe. Oh, come on, please, I beg. Bang, white Zamba, Neo-Yo, okay, all right. I think I should do another crate battle with these modded crates, honestly, because I know I do a lot of like the real crate battles and like the drop crate battles, but the problem with the drops, like the exotic drops and black market drops, Ah, cobalt wet paint, okay. Like exotic, it's only exotic and black market, and then black market, it's only black market. So it just gets old seeing the same rarities over and over. But the problem with the real crates is they give you rares 60% of the time, and then very rares like 30% of the time, whatever it is. You're, you're getting such crap always. Like, did you see the crate battle I did with Tri House? We didn't even get a single exotic or black market the entire time. And that's just not exciting for me. Like, I want to be excited when I have crate battle. And when your luck just sucks the whole time. It's Yeah, it's exciting when it's like a close score. Okay, we keep getting titanium white rares. Come on, just give us a white mainframe already. Um, it's just more exciting when you have better luck. And say you're crate battling and you do double points and you get this. Okay, really, really game? You, you couldn't just throw me a bone, give me a black marker there. All right, say I'm in a crate battle. Double points. Oh my. Okay, now it's giving me actual crate battle luck. Really? Gaiden, thank you. Okay, crate battle, double points. Okay. <laughs> oh my. Dude, it knows. It knows that I'm trying to prove something to you guys. Okay, I'm not going to say anything. Okay, actually, what is my luck right now? What is my luck right now? These are modded drops. It keeps giving me rares. Black market, please. Bruh. Another very rare? Reap. Oh my. Okay, my point is, you're much more likely to get bangers 
in these than in real <laughs> drops. Most of the time, except for right now when I'm trying to prove it. Oh my. How many rares and very rares? How many? Bruh. Come on. Import or higher. I, uh... This is actually the worst luck I've ever had with modded drops. Ever. This is insane. There's no way. There's actually no way. How am I getting so many rares? Bro. Did they change the odds for the mod? Okay. We finally got a black market. Jeez. That took a while. <sighs> okay. Import. There we go. I'm just sick of seeing rares and very rares. But, uh, as you guys can see, what? I've gotten three or four, five black markets now. Orange shattered. Ooh. It's kind of like a gold shattered. Kind of. I guess burnt sienna would be more gold, but... Uh, and that's in, like, less than 40 crates. So that would be, like, in a crate battle scenario, each person gets two, three, like, markets. Which is way more exciting, you know? Fortnite literally gets an update that you can create anything in the entire universe in the game. Orange mainframe, that's cool, but it's not white mainframe. And then... Rocket League, what do we get? More DLC items added to the item shop. Oh, great. Oh, we get a cool Shinjuku decal. Thank you. It looks amazing, but would like some more. You know, I would like some more from this game. Whenever it uh, starts to give me an item, it just gives me repeats of it over and over. that didn't look white tell me that did not look white that looks white man oh why you gotta troll me like that game i was so excited i was like yes video's over and it's under 20 minutes let's go i would prefer that you don't skip ah ah Purple. Oh, man. What is... What is that paint now? It's purple, pink. What was the first one? Orange. I'll be honest. I just want maybe a hundred more unpainted mainframes, please. Now, let me be clear. I'm just gonna clarify this for the people that are still watching, the five of you that are still watching. Gray main frames are no longer in the game. That is why they are so valuable. They're like 80,000, 90,000 credits because they were taken out of rotation. So the only ones that exist were the ones that existed for a little bit before Psyonix realized, wait, gray mainframe and white mainframe look exactly the same. So we're gonna take out gray mainframe because there's no point in having it. That's why they're worth so much, because there's only like probably a few hundred of them in existence or a thousand of them, whatever, however many there are. But you cannot open them from crates anymore. You can't get them from trade ups anymore. So that's why they're valuable. This is a mod so I can get anything, including things that you can't get anymore.
I... <sighs> those are so good. These don't exist in the game, but they're so good. Black Infiniums. Why don't these exist, man? Yeah, I'm not, I'm not really too upset anymore because it's just whatever. Okay, really quickly, let's just take a look at the inventory. Oh my... Oh, look at all the repeats. Oh my gosh. Oh, look at all the mainframes. Wait, how many? Purple. We got orange, gray, black, pink, crimson. Oh my. Yeah, I'm like thinking about all the different scenarios for this video, like... Ladies and gentlemen, after 800 crates in two hours, we've finally gotten a Titanium White Black Market. The titanium White Shattered. Uh, if you were expecting a good reaction, then uh, sorry to disappoint, but... If I had gotten that in the first maybe 30 minutes, I probably would have had a really good reaction. But after two hours of opening crates, my reactions are not going to be up to par with what you would expect from me. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. And we'll catch you in the next one. <laughs> Peace.